Okay, you're probably asking why I've got yellow fingers. Um, What's up guys, it's Lee here, the bartending photo boothing rental guy, and today we're gonna teach you to make some stencils for stuff for your business. Brand your stuff. If you're anything like me, you always think about it, and you mean to do it, but you never do. So today's video is about stencils. So mark your stuff with stencils if you can. Boxes like this so that when they're on site, people know that you're yours, if, that they're yours. If you leave anything behind, you've got some stencils. Uh, this goes for stickers as well. So this year I've uh, invested in some stickers and I've made some stencils, but this video is about stencils. And I have to give a shout out to Gorth Bellion because he made a bunch of stencils, sent me some pictures of them uh, on his rental equipment. And even though I had it in my mind to do the stencils, I never actually physically made myself do it until I saw him doing it. So uh, this video is inspired by Gorth Ballion. So I'll put the link to his channel right here. And uh, if you haven't seen him, go sub to him. He's awesome for rental stuff. He's awesome for rental stuff. He's uh, the guy who taught me everything about what I'm doing, so. Anyways, let's get into stencils. So if you've seen some of my older videos, you know I have this machine called the Cricut Explore Air 2. Uh, basically, it's a cutting machine. So you put a design in and it cuts out whatever you want. I've made car decals and now I'm making these stencils. So I use a program with it called, uh, well, it's the program with the Cricut, but I also have another design program called Vintage Logo Design. So here I am designing the logo that I'm gonna do for the stencils. So yeah, branding things. It just makes you look a little more professional. Uh, I think that helps people take you more seriously too if you just take the time to uh, present yourselves better. Uh, the next thing for me is uh, doing sp uh, special clothing branding for on-site tent setups. Okay, if we don't get a drip on that A there, then this is gonna look okay. <laughs> So I chose this color, um, it's just catchy. I, even in my online store, uh, which I'll show you right here, you'll see that my uh, cart button is this color and uh, I just feel like it's easy for people to notice this color. So uh, I've chosen this color as my uh, identifier. What's your identifying color? Still looks cool though. 